how can we use this private key in order to decrypt an encrypted password? Let's find out. Hello everybody, welcome back to this new episode of the Basilic CTF challenge, which is also available on RootMe. And we are on room 12, just ourselves. And we're trying to solve that really interesting challenge. So we were able to crack the public key and we were able to extract the content of the private key using RSA CTF tool. I highly encourage you to watch the previous episodes. You can find the links in the description box. So I'm going to put that into CTF's basilic key dot private. Paste it. Now, RSA CTF tool allows also to uncipher any cipher text. So we can use uncipher file and we can provide it with the uh, encrypted password path. So that would be under hacking, uh, sorry. That would be where, where, where? EC, CTFs, Basilic. And we want dot encrypted password to be decrypted. All right, let's give it a try. Hmm, don't have anything. Private argument is not set. The private key will not be displayed even if recovered. Well, doesn't seem to work. Let's uh, see what do we have in the help menu. So RSA. Mahada. Partial. So here we specify the public key, the output create pub dump key cipher uncipher file. So this is what we were using and private show factors password key. I'm not sure what are these key specify the private key file. Oh, okay. So we can specify it like this private and here we want to use the key uh, option. Hit enter and we get something here. What is this? This is the string? Oh, really? So this is the plain text password. Uh, it doesn't seem like it. You know what? I'm going to use OpenSSL. So OpenSSL. I can also ask uh, ChatGPT, but let's just stick with Google for now. Maybe that's uh, for another time. Public key encryption. Okay. I want to decrypt. Decrypt. Generate the key pairs. We don't want that. Yeah. Step five, decrypt the file using private key. Open SSL. And then take all this in and paste it right here. So instead of top secret, we want the uh, path to our password. Yeah. Let me just type it manually. That would be quicker. CTFs, uh, Basilic and encrypted password. And the private key would be our path to the private key. Okay, let's hit enter and we have something never gonna give you up. Okay, what is this? Can we use it some uh, like a password? I'm not sure. Let's uh, let's try that. Um, so SSH uh, Basilic, I guess that's the user we want to uh, log in with and we found his uh, or her encrypted password. So let's try rootme.org basilic and with the password never gonna give you up. Enter. Well, we are under the basilic user inside the uh, basilic server. Perfect. That's really cool. 
In the next video, we're going to see how we could, how we can escalate our privileges. We're hungry to get root. Basilic is just the way. But meanwhile, let's celebrate our achievement. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the ring bell so that you get notified as soon as I publish the video. As always, stay curious, keep learning, and go find some bugs.